What's up, Lucci gang? Welcome back to Luciano TV. It's another day, another day on quarantine. Baby girl making some werewolf ranchettos. For those of y'all that don't know what that is, that's my favorite meal for breakfast. With some little Smokies. Oh shit. <laughs> Just dripped everything, hold it. I'm not letting. He legit dripped the juice. I just opened the pack. I'm gonna end up smushing my salsa into like some liquid and then adding the little smokies. Tell them how you do it, baby. Tell them how you do it. Mmm, smells good. You know what you're doing? What's this called? A wok? A cayete, you stupid ass. A cayete? A morcaete. Oh, love, baby. She in here cooking like grandma. Lucky would usually just leave it like this on top of, like, he would just throw the chopped up. I'll just put throw that right on top of my eggs without chopping it up. And it doesn't taste bad, but it just tastes better when it's like... Oh. Yo, I've never worked with one of these rocks. You okay? You going into labor? Y'all, I'm having pains and it's getting worse and worse. I think she's gonna have the baby today. <sighs> I don't know about today, maybe tomorrow, maybe this week. I don't know, but it's getting real. So today we need to go pack our bags and get everything we need to go to the hospital because we ain't even packed a bag yet. And it's not that we haven't packed a bag, it's just that since we have to be quarantined in the hospital while we're there having the baby and like you can't leave at all, like, we have to pack stuff for him. Like, he can't even go to the cafeteria or walk around the hospital. So... I ain't trying to walk around the hospital. Yeah, man. We're eating on paper plates because don't nobody like washing dishes. Thank you, Jesus, for this food. And my beautiful Kelly Jean. Amen. Amen. Oh, you want another candy? No. <laughs> They're not even candy, they're breath mints. We're on our way to Target. I know we're not supposed to be out nowhere, but we don't got a bag. We don't have our bag ready for uh, this labor we're about to go through. And we need to go get prepared. We need a, a bag of Doritos. <laughs> so I just got back from my doctor's appointment, you guys. And uh, I asked her all the questions that I needed to answer. Lucky is not gonna be able to leave the room at all. She said to come prepared. She said that they are keeping us for two days, but I am able to ask, you are like shaking this camera like crazy. So we're gonna be locked down for real for two days. You know what no. I'm saying? We're gonna be in quarantine at the hospital for two but days. But what I was trying to tell y'all is that she did say that I can request to leave after 24 hours. After the baby turns 24 hours, um, we can ask to leave uh, and she will approve of it. If the labor goes good and we are both healthy, the baby and I. So, we still need to go pack some stuff just in case anything. All right. You sent me the list already what we need? <laughs> yes. Lucky doesn't want to wear a mask, but I'm telling him he has to. I specifically grabbed one for him. Are you ready? I'm ready. I ain't got nothing wrong with me. This is just to stop me from getting germs on somebody, but I don't got germs. It's y'all that got the germs. Well, we just pulled up to Target and... We are ready to go. I got the list, let's go. I almost forgot I was vlogging. This is what I got so far. Baby stuff, onesies. Kelly, some house shoes. Now let me get the snacks. favorite chocolate. Cookies. All right, I 
think we're ready. I think we're ready. Let's All go. right, we made it back. Got the goods. Now we're just ready for this baby to come on with it. So what you get, baby? Let's see what you got. Surprise you. Got you some lotion. Some lotion. Some facial cleaner. Some face wash. This is essential. Listerine so your breath don't be kicking. Some deodorant. It's just for a couple days. Your deodorant. Okay. I know they look big, but they're medium. They're gonna fit you perfect. Yep, they're soft and cozy. Thank you, babe. What else you get? Oh, these are so cute. The baby needed hats. He definitely needed hats. Got him some hats. He ready. Oh, these are pajamas. Got you some PJs. Oh, the, I like these. I like these a lot. Oh, well, you didn't like the pants? Not really. <laughs> oh, yes. You got me some comfy slippers. I needed these, you guys. My other ones are like super, 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 super flat and just worn out. Oh, got the baby some gloves. Sorry, I'm scratching yourself. He needed that. A whole bunch of snacks. And some cookies. Some chips. More cookies. Funyuns. Goldfish. Or a goldfish for them. Baby, more onesies for the baby. You can't never have enough onesies. Got you a razor. <laughs> oh, you're so thoughtful. Bottles, so, we needed bottles. bottles, you guys. This is like the only thing that the baby did not have, other than the hats and the gloves. Some more clothes. Oh, you know what I'm saying? So cute. This is so cute. Welcome to the world. Oh. Right now, uh, take a thumbnail. Okay, <laughs> some more onesies, more onesies, little PJs. Oh, this is so cute! You went in. Okay, now we're ready. I got drinks. Okay, yeah, so drinks, and I think that's it. Yeah. We good, we ready, right? That's all we needed. Got the essentials, got his clothes, his bottles, some drinks for us. We ready now to go. Now we gotta pack. We gotta pack the bag now. I skipped this bag over here, but he got my favorite chocolate, you guys. I love these. What? He's like, wait, you have another baby coming? Oh, <laughs> Houston, the baby's coming. Look, this for baby Ro. All right, let's put this up. Oh, we're going to pack it? So Adam right. took everything out of the bags, and we have the Funyuns, Doritos, some cookies, some more cookies, some chocolates, Gatorades, um, this, what is this? Bye. Some drink that Lucky likes to drink, and coffees. I have hair tie scrunchies my pjs and then we also have like a little headrest for the baby right here and two blankets two soft blankets they are new and washed and then i have his little pacifier some people call it a binky why <laughs> anyways we have the socks we have his i think this is gonna be his coming home outfit what do you think babe yeah i like this and then like a little pajamas and then also I have these little like rags for him and some long sleeve onesies. And then this is for his car seat. It attaches. So I'm gonna have that in the, I think I'm gonna leave this out of the bag and then just have it ready for the car seat. We need to get the car seat ready as well. I don't know if this is backwards or what is this? Is this, a, I don't know. Anyways, I also have some little like travel sized conditioner and shampoo. I have the Chi and then Paul Mitchell as well. We have our deodorants, his and hers, some face wash, a hairbrush, Listerine lotion, body wash, and a toothpaste. Houston, you ready for your baby brother? 
Yeah. yeah. So yeah, Dad. So I do have a list of like things that we need to grab whenever we're like at that moment where it's like it's time we got to get in the car and head to the hospital which is like headphones charger like just things that we don't want to forget and we're gonna need while we're there um so we are gonna go ahead and start packing i am gonna just end up taking a whole suitcase go ahead because we're still gonna end up packing like a blanket for him to sleep um because them hospital blankets are not comfortable. The baby stuff. Baby rope. Yeah. And then also like his robe and his clothes and things that he's gonna need um while he's there. So I'm gonna go ahead and put I put all of like our little shampoos and um restroom things in this top zipper i don't know if i can see right here um i'm gonna go ahead and start in the inside let's see so i think i'm gonna start with his blankies look let me show y'all his blankets you guys this is so cute and fluffy so put this in here And then I have another one as well. You know what I don't have out here is like the little swaddle blankies. I have a lot of those that Houston left. So we really didn't buy any oh. new ones. I like had a whole bunch. I'm gonna take these two and put them in there next. Pack that, his little sockies and onesies. Then also his little headrest. And like I said, I'm gonna leave this out. That way we can just put it in the car seat once we set that up. My clothes, which is gonna be just my PJs. So all the snacks, I'm gonna bag this up maybe in like a backpack, put the snacks and stuff separately. I did forget to put this in the little pot right here and that's basically it i do have that list like i said of like all the other things that we're gonna need um so i'm probably just gonna get that the day of and just add it into this bag right here this other little pouch that we have right here and we also have a another pouch right here and there's still a lot of room right here to put like my coming home outfit Lucky's blanket and some of his clothes in here. Um, so yeah, you guys, we're getting ready for baby roll. I do want to let y'all know that y'all need to like stay updated with all of our vlogs because I am 37 weeks pregnant, which means the baby can come any day now. I have been having contractions. They're not intense. They're not, you know, it's not time just yet, but he is coming. 37 weeks i think that we're gonna have the baby sometime next week latest next week so y'all stay tuned like he's about to make some lunch so let's go check out what he's got going on all right y'all want to buy me something for my birthday april 20th buy me some knives kitchen cutting knives and makes our lunch for today. I am going to be back with y'all once it's all done and ready and let y'all know on. what it tastes like. Leave the camera rolling. Come show them how I do this. Y'all want to see how I do this, don't y'all? Don't you? That's Lucky's dad pose, you guys. <laughs> That's my boss man pose right there, man. That's what that is. Anyway, <clears throat> I'm, I was sitting here contemplating. I was contemplating trying to see if I should put the top on this or not. What you think? Yeah. Put the top on it, right?
subscribe to Kingston's vlogs. They're good, I already had it. Especially with some hot chocolate or coffee. Mmm. Flip these tortillas over, man. Right now we're in the midst of trying to teach Leah Leah to not be afraid of the tortilla and flip the tortilla. Go ahead, Leah. Let's see if you can do it. Come on, come on, come on. Quickly. Bam! Hey. Y'all don't know how many, how many months we've been trying to get her to do that. Well, we got our tortillas on deck. Got our carne guisada with papas on deck. Our refried beans on deck. That's a big hefty lunch right there. Big hefty lunch. That's a boss lunch right there, man. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Ah, oh, still eating on them paper plates. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. All right, the first birthday shout out goes to Hector Mesa, turning 44 years old from Wharton, Texas. Happy birthday to you. The next birthday shout out goes to Bianca Escamilla, turning 23 years old. Next happy birthday shout out goes to Elsa Carrillo from Santa Mateo, California. The next birthday shout out goes to Liliana Briseño, turning seven years old. Happy birthday to you, Liliana. All right, man, I hope you're having a good day. Remember, stay in the house and watch Luciano TV. We packed and ready to go? Yes, we are. Baby Christian De Niro on the way.